Hey everybody, today I'm going to talk really quickly about ant moats and utilizing these moats to stop ants from getting to your feeders, particularly hummingbird feeders, which ants are really attracted to because of the sugar water. These are a couple different versions I have that I use in my yard. Uh, there's a ton of different varieties, a ton of different colors. Ant moats are really fun though. They, uh, they're very simple to use. Normally when you purchase one, you've got a hook on the bottom where your feeder is going to go. You've got a hook that goes on the top that usually just screws in. Or at least these are the styles that I've always purchased. Double hooks. And the idea is you fill this compartment with water. And we'll go ahead and do that now. And as you put the water in, basically you're setting it up to where as ants try and get to your feeder, they're going to hit this pool of water that they're not going to be able to get past. But what's great with ant moats is not only are they stopping ants from your feeders, but they're also giving your other wildlife water if they want to drink water. I've seen a lot of house finches and cardinals particularly love to go to these ant moats and get water out of them. So I'm going to go ahead and hang this up and just show you what it looks like. But it's very simple. The water is in the moat. Go ahead and hang your ant moat and hang your feeder. And again, what I like about ant moats is they give you more color in your yard. You can get different colors of these so you can have more variety in your yard. But again, you're giving water to creatures up top, you're stopping ants, and then you're still setting up your hummingbird feeder uh, to where you don't have to worry about ants. But anyway, big box stores usually carry these. A lot of times they're less than $5. They're not very expensive, or you can also search online. But if you're not using an ant moat, I've done other videos talking about ways to stop ants in your yard, but this really is the most simple solution. Uh, and these are great to have if you haven't used them in your yard. So anyway, I hope this video helps you out. Happy birding.